Okay. We have one that has completely unzipped and is trying to make its debut. Don't mind the dog. As you can see, it has unzipped, which means it's gone completely around the egg, which is the proper way to do it. There's the beak. There's the beak. It's coming. Now they do take rest because this is a lot of work. So they'll push a little bit and then they'll rest a little bit. Oh, it's coming. Very exciting time. Yes. Oh. PRS. What? It's PRS. Yes, that's what I said. Plymouth Partridge Plymouth Rock. I don't think you have one of those. It looks like that. Not yet. Partridge Plymouth Rock. It's almost out though. So as you can see that white membrane is holding the hard shell together. And we talked about the Ooh, different membranes. Okay, we're getting closer. <gasps> oh, we're getting closer. You can kind of see the fur on this side. Uh -huh. oh. Come over here, Mom. It's like. You can see more of the chick. Here we go. Is that? Watch out, dog. Come, come watch it. It's coming out. Yay! It's almost there. Look over here. Almost. Here we go. He's coming. Looks like his pouch jack. His okay, I see one, one wing is coming out. Here we go. Here we go. He's wiggling his almost. way out. Almost. He's almost in the light. He's still. Yep. Because remember, it's ta they're taking a rest. A couple more final pushes. I see the wing. The wing over here. Oh. oh, here we go. Just gotta push the final egg part off of its head. And then it will be free to take a rest. There it is. There it is. Congratulations.
Congratulations, little guy. You're the first one to hatch. Where's Grace? <coughs> no, Jack. Okay, so at this point, the, the chick has come completely out of the egg and it is resting. This chick will take little flops here and there to try and get its bearings. It has, it's learning how to walk like any um, creature in the wild. This has taken a lot of effort to come out of the egg. So frequent rests and short bursts of energy uh, will be what we're gonna be seeing in the next couple of hours. It will take quite a few hours for the chick to be completely dry. And it has to stay in the incubator until it's completely dry. We cannot open the lid. We also can't open the lid if there's any other eggs that have pips on them because the uh, humidity will escape and the eggs might shrink wrap around the, uh, that chick that's also trying to hatch. So as you can see, they're not really that cute yet, but he, will, he or she will fluff up and be adorable. And the noise that this chick is making will encur encourage others to hatch as well. So this is the beginning of some really cool excitement and I'll keep you posted. Hey, let's go check out that other egg, which is right here. So as you can see, this chick is really struggling, but she's moving inside. She's having a much more difficult time of it than the other one because she uh, started so early. I'm going to try and refer to them as she's because we want them all to be hens. Sorry, rooster fans out there, but hens are actually the ones that feed us. So this one is still trying, um, and we're hoping that she, she makes it. Now these chicks can last two to three days on just the absorption of the egg yolk because that has all those proteins in them that uh, will feed them for a couple days. So I don't have to worry about feeding them at all, uh, which is good. That's nature's way of providing their needs while they uh, fluff up and, and stay warm. Now, if I turn this around, you'll see that the humidity has skyrocketed up to 86% humidity. That's because it took all of this effort and the chick is so wet, but the chick will dry off. Okay, so it's quite cool. She's peeping. Mm-hmm. Isn't that cute? Okay, just take one last, one last look over here at this one. And let's check on this other egg. Still a pip there. Not much is happening. Oh, that one just moved. This one is moving. Okay, still working on it. Okay, we'll keep you posted. Think of some names for this little guy or girl. Okay, so apparently, the one really encouraged the other one to hatch. Well, hello, little guy. Didn't see him come out or her. That is exciting, though. I'm glad they made it out. Brahma, light Brahma, and Partridge Plymouth Rock. They're doing pretty good.